All right. In fact, uh, we're just uh, getting news of uh, how a TMC versus BJP war of words has uh, hit an ugly low. Mamta's aide Kalyan Banerjee has called the Prime Minister the son of a rat. Listen in. All right, Rahul Sena of the BJP is with us on the phone line. Now, Rahul Sena, first reaction to what Kalyan Banerjee has said. Look, Kalyan Banerjee is an advocate. He says that he is a man who 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 is a man. प्राइम मिनिस्टर को इन्होंने जिस ढंग से अटैक किया, बिजले का साथ प्राइम मिनिस्टर का तुलना कर रहा है, तो ऐसा अग्नि को तो संक्षत रहने ही नहीं चाहिए, इसको तो संक्षत में ही कार्रवाई होना चाहिए इसके खिलाफ, और यहाँ हम लोगों ने इनके खिलाफ काले एफआईआर भी दर्ज किया, उत्तर पर पुलिस स्टेशन में, और इनके इनके बातों का कोई महत्व नहीं देना चाहता है जिसका टीम संसद कहने का लायक भी आदमी नहीं है जैसा जैसा भाषा बार बार इन्होंने प्रयोग कर रहे हैं। But आपको लगता नहीं है कि दोनों तरफ से ही गलती हो रही है पिछले कुछ दिनों में हमने बीजेपी की तरफ से भी कुछ बहुत स्ट्रॉंग वर्ड्स देखे हैं इस्त देखिए एकाद भाषा कभी बीजेपी से निकल गया लेकिन कल्याण बनर्जी इन्होंने तो लगातार बोल रहा है ऐसा भाषा और चुनावों का बाकी लीडर लोग बोल ही रहा है बाकी लीडर लोगों में से कल्याण बनर्जी सबसे एक नंबर है जिन्होंने ऐसा गंदा वार्ड यूज करने में माही है एक एडवोकेट का और सांसद का ऐसा बी मतलब ही नहीं है जो कल्याण बनर्जी करते हैं हम इसका तीव्रों निंदा करते हैं और इनके खिलाफ कार्रवाई का मांग करते हैं। All right, Rahul Sena, thank you very much for joining us. The BJP saying that action should be taken against Kalyan Banerjee, but the question is by who? Indrajit, my colleague, also with us on the phone line. Now, what is the context? Why was such language used by Kalyan Banerjee about the Prime Minister, Indrajit? Well, Padma Jha, you know, it's the third and penultimate day of uh, nationwide protest by the Srinamul Congress uh, against uh, the arrest of Sudhir Bandhapadhyay uh, by the CBI in the Rose Valley camp. Uh, the Trinamool Congress, of course, has termed this political vendetta. And just in a short while from now, even Chief Minister Mamata Banji will be joining the Tharna that is, and the demonstration that is taking place for the past three days outside the RBI office here in Kolkata. So, uh, Kalyan Banerjee was speaking at the same occasion just a short while back when he took to the stage uh, and he uh, made certain a, a very objectionable remarks as far as the Prime Minister is concerned. We played that out. Uh, it will be interesting to see how the MP now reacts to his latest uh, jives. But I can tell you, Padma Jha, in his own constituency in Hooghly district, the BJP has uh, put in a complaint with the Uttarpara police station because this is not the first time... All right, just stay with me, Indrajit. We've got Kalyan Banerjee with us on the phone line now. Mr. Banerjee, why did you use this language about the Prime Minister? Yes, Prime Minister is behaving in such a fashion. That is the reason I have said so. Prime Minister is autopsied, Prime Minister is uh, exercising his power. Uh, Fortunately, Prime Minister abusing his power. He is behaving like a lion. And after 2019, he will lose the election. I think he will. He will he has to, today he is behaving the, like a lion. He has to behave. He has to be. Uh, he has to be behave like a rat. Mr. Banerjee, of course, you call him. Uh, authoritarian, dictatorial, whatever you will. But you will also agree that there has to be a certain standard that must be maintained in political discourse, don't you think? And this falls way below that? First you tell your Prime Minister to maintain standards. When he... 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 When
has uh, got a, a huge psychological stroke from a demonetization decision and all of them have actually been speaking uh, incoherently speaking uh, making uh, nonsensical comments and uh, ha- you see mamta banerji is a very very mature politician a very successful politician but a person like her says i don't want this prime minister i want to change prime minister so unless somebody has got a ser- serious uh, psychological ailment why would anybody make such comments because she is not the, the one who chooses the prime minister so so this party i think across the entire cadre base of the party seems to have received a mental stroke uh, following the demonetization decision therefore they are speaking in uh, 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 in the kind of uh, language hmm. that no civil or no sensible person would do but jivel as about how when i was just speaking to kalyan manager that was his very objection that the reason why he's so enraged and he's used such language about the prime ministers because people like him parties like his just because they are picking up the common man's issue are being labeled black money hoarders which he thinks is unfair and which is why he is attacking the pm and your party i uh, i know but but you uh, know the real problem is they have suffered severe losses i think that's what they don't speak they can't honestly admit that they seem to have suffered huge losses they and this acted as a, some kind of a psychological stroke on their mind but uh, in politics the accusations and and charge allegations against opposition is not something new but uh, the kind of comments they are making even i i mentioned even what mamta banerjee has said you you i'm sure you are aware of that she mm. said i want to change pm I, i these are acceptable to me these are not acceptable there is a national government to be formed i think only nobody in his uh, in her right senses uh, who is really not gone mad would would make such statements because there is uh, there, there is absolutely these comments are highly uh, not only unwarranted mm. they are completely uh, illusory so when somebody starts living in illusory world i think the best thing is they should consult a psychiatrist i'm i'm told calcutta has some good hospitals for mental treatment and they should all admit themselves so that they don't pose a threat to the people of bengal All right uh, Jewel Aswara thank you very much uh, for joining us uh, there are political differences but can we have at least a certain standard in the kind of language that is used in political discourse doesn't seem like that anymore listen in to Kalyan Banerjee